they filthy stallion. Anyways, um, so finally I'm on the third, uh, about to reach the third dungeon after God okay. knows, yeah, just, what? and I just fucking died. Under. I just want. I also just wanted to say, yeah, this oh. is coming from like my 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 price manager, <laughs> Master Code. I'm the uh, marketing manager. Yeah. <laughs> Missing my marketing are manager still is a filthy stallion. I believe a hero will rescue them. What? What did I say? Uh, oh, cool! See, I got a mirror. Mares, uh, at least at least three. Someone said, asked me how many mirrors. Uh, it needs to be at least three. <sighs> at least three mirrors. Who do you want the bears to be? Surprise me. Maybe it's less words. Ah, that feels better. Ow! God damn it! <sighs> Pascal, what's your favorite kind of pizza style? Crust and toppings. Um, I like thin crust. I don't mind whichever crust it is, but I mostly go for thin. Um, I love that crust. Extra thick. Extra thick. I'm actually not like picky. Pan pizza. Yeah, I'm actually not picky. However, like my favorite of all favorite pizzas is the margarita, which has a thin, thin crust. Mm. The, the margarita is a mozzarella, pizza sauce, basil, and tomatoes. That's all it is. Very wow. simple. Hmm. Interesting. And it's also based off the name of a real royal from Italy. Damn it. Ugh. That's why it's one of the more popular pizzas. <clears throat> Christ. Jesus, this is ridiculous. Ben, what kind of toppings do y'all like on your pizza? Extra cheese. That's yep, it? Really? And that or pepperoni. Um, yeah. I personally, okay, I as far like as what my favorite combinations are, God, I can be all over the place. I'm also, like, I kind of keep myself, like, pretty much more open and universal, with the exception of onions and pep uh, bell peppers. I can't stand having those. Ah, oh, you're killing me, Golden. Killing I, me, Smalls. I don't like bell peppers either. Yeah, I, mean, no. I don't like, I don't like eggplant, anchovies, squash... I never had I don't those. Like any of that. Well, I, anchovies is a type of fish. I'm not putting fish on my pizza. Fuck that. Um, Fuck that shit. I don't like I'm out. Choke syrup plant. So, yeah. Oh my god. god. All right. Anything else is fair game for me. I will. I remember once I had a deep dish and everybody acknowledged that I basically put the entire garden on my pizza. <laughs> All right. Here we go. The third dungeon. For the third pendant. I don't know where I are to go first. Time to explore! Get a shrine of the silver monkey. Ooh, the that's got to hurt, brass. Owie. Did you have to go back to the dentist for that? What happened? He made the mistake of eating a Hawaiian pizza a week after getting his wisdom teeth removed. Oh! And he got oh. pineapple chunks stuck in the holes where the teeth used to be. All four of them. Ooh. Brass! Boy! You should have given yourself two weeks! Jeez Louise. Oh, God, that is going to be painful. I, I I imagine you had to go back to the doc, to the dentist immediately. Holy crap, baskets. Yeah, for the first two weeks, I just, I just had chicken soup for like two weeks straight after I got all my molars pulled. Ow! Yeah, it took me about two weeks to heal. <sighs> Although it was actually yeah. the most relaxing week of my whole entire life, probably. <laughs> it was not for me. I was, I was quote unquote, bitch Zilla. <laughs> I was, it was actually, where, where was it? It was like, um, college or, it was either college or high school. I can't remember. It was like, it was like that transitional period. Oh! Anyway, um, I, I, I actually got my molars pulled like during spring break. I was like, oh, great. There goes my spring break. So, um, after, after the whole procedure, I was like, Oh god, here comes the pain. It's like it wasn't as bad at first. Like it, like like feel it, but it's like oh great, it's gonna come later. And then by the end of the day, I barely felt there was like a little twinge of pain. Ah oh, shit! Second day, there was like nothing. A thought just and... occurred to me. I hope that the boss is not the fucking snake guy. 
Oh. And it wasn't as bad experience as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> With me, um, well, here's the thing. So they had to remove all four of my wisdom teeth plus an additional tooth that, like, it was an extra tooth that never came in. And it was at the, my bottom jaw. <clears throat> so, and they also had to drill my wisdom teeth out because they weren't fully growing in. But the way they were growing in, they were basically pushing my other teeth forward. Mm. So they knocked me out with like an IV and laughing gas. And then when I came to, uh, and they had me hide up on Vicodin. Holy crap. Oh, oh wow. Vicodin. And Vicodin <laughs> and I do not mix very well. It heightened my paranoia and anger. Uh, oh, Bliss, fuck did, my I ever, life. did I ever tell you what happened when I was on Vicodin? Uh, what happened to you? I what couldn't stop. Story? I'm afraid to ask. What is Vicodin? <laughs> It's a pain med, but I couldn't think of anything but the opening the the show Space House? Jam for an hour. I don't watch House. Oh, shit. I okay, Vi okay, let me explain. Vi Vicodin is is a heavy-duty pain medication. Like, they don't give that to you lightly. It's It can be very addictive, too, if you're not careful. Well, yeah. yeah pain I, meds and me don't mix. I usually yeah. tend to just take an Advil. But yeah, Vicodin had heightened my paranoia and anger and it also made me itch <laughs> but yeah like so when i was coming to my instinct was to fight and get up and i, I yell fuck you where's my mom i was a teenager too so give me a break <laughs> <laughs> of <laughs> course it would make sense Stray me like ma'am ma'am please you need to sit back i said fuck you i'll take you all on <laughs> fuck <laughs> you <laughs> fuck you very much <laughs> my mom hears me from the other room, and she immediately just she just pump, comes in and says, "Whoa, whoa, whoa. okay, uh, Doc, I'll take it from here. I'll, I got her. I got her. I'm so sorry." And uh, yeah, this went to so many stories. Like as soon as my mom got me home, one of the rules wait, 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 they wait, told wait, wait, wait. me What's I couldn't this? do was lay down. I couldn't lay down to sleep. I had to be sitting up for at least four hours. And that's the last thing I wanted to do. I just wanted to lie down and sleep until the pain was gone. Yes! Wow, I've even already got the big key. With, yay! Even with Vicodin, I was still in a great deal of pain. And my sister used to have a chihuahua named Major. I kid, I kid you not. And he knew I was in a great deal of pain. And bless his little heart, he came into my room, leapt on my bed, and sat on my chest. But because my Vicodin was making me extremely aggressive, I Shit. grabbed him and threw him off me. <gasps> yeah. But here's the shock. Here comes the shocker. He didn't care. He got back up and got on top of me again. This repeated three times where I threw him off. Oh my I god. I grabbed him and I threw him. And I remember doing this. I was just so angry. I didn't understand why. I just remember being angry and seeing red. But he kept coming back. Oh, wait. I think I've already and, been here. And I ended up giving up and fell asleep. I wake up about a few hours later, and he's still there laying on top of me. Because <laughs> he was so worried about me. It was a good dog. That, you know, just hearing that, I just want to cry. Point. I know. I want to cry too. He was such a good dog. Okay, I swear. Like, it, okay. There, here's the sad thing about me. When it comes to, um, sometimes when it comes to uh, having animals, you know, take a certain, uh, not a beating, but something that puts him in a rough situation. Yeah. It does make me want to burst into tears. I have too much of a soft spot for animals or dogs. Um. Oh. You're like, okay, how many of you seen the movie Hachi, A Dog's Tale? What, what was it? You cut off. Hachi, A Dog's Tale. Oh, God, I cry so hard. <laughs> it's not fair. And the thing, that's, the thing that sucks about all of it is that everybody tried to reason with Hachi. Well, everyone tried to get him to come home or befriend somebody else, but it was just physically impossible. This dog was too loyal, too blindly loyal, waiting for his owner. And the thing is about that breed of dog, that actually is a trait of theirs. 
they tend to bond with that one person and they tend to bond with that one person for life. Also, Lego, yes, it is based on a true story. And I actually want to add something here. Um, yes, it is based on a true story, but uh, the way they approached it, the movie, it took place in modern day, but the actual event took place in the 30s in Japan. Oh, that was the... Okay. I but, thought it was... Yeah, but... Yeah, but you know how I knew about it? Because at the <laughs> end of the movie, there's a wall of text that actually reveals what really happened. And I like that the movie was fully honest about that, and it was just delivering a spin that would connect to um, the Americans in order to grab its audience better. I think the movie was fi like uh, filmed by... Um, produced by Japanese people with Richard Gere. Okay. I, I don't I know, know if that. that's true, but I actually do appreciate that it reveals, like... The true, like, facts and not just, you know, blindly telling you, oh, this is just a true story and not, like, make you look so gullible. Like, they'll actually, like, they will tell it to you. Okay. Yeah. I like that, yeah. But, yeah, no, that's... I that, haven't seen A Dog's Purpose, though. I haven't seen it either. Um, I, t I have seen um, Marley and Me, and that was actually hard to watch. That was hard for me to watch, too. It's like that, that dog represented everything I would hate about a dog that was just not right in my family, but you love them anyway. Yeah, they call him the world's worst dog, but deep down you still love him. Makes you feel all the feels. Yeah. Yeah, they, no, they did not fall to it, thank Christ. <laughs> and that's the thing. The other, of, go ahead. Uh, the other movies I love that are based off true bits are Secretariat and... Uh, Ah, Secretariat. I remember uh, seeing that movie. You know, movie. to this day, his record has still not been beaten. There has been one horse that actually did successfully complete the Triple Crown, but not in his time. Shit, how do I get to that? That, that horse has never been beaten in regards to time. I'll bet that's impressive. <laughs> Secretariat. It, I don't think his... I don't think his record will ever be broken. He did the one thing that a lot of racehorses believe is physically impossible. And what's that? Be well, there's no such. There typically is no such thing as a horse that both that has both speed and stamina, but he was able to do both. Hmm. Instead of slowing down, like in the last race when he was against his opponent, it was expected that his, his opponent was all about stamina and they knew he was all about speed and they knew they were just going to run him down until he got tired towards the final stretch. Um, especially because of the fact that this is based off true events. They actually trained secretariat even harder for the final race instead of letting him rest like other people think they should. Um, is that no, what the movie did too? Like show um... Yeah, the movie the movie showed that too. Basically they trained Secretariat even harder for the next race because the owner believed that if they train him harder, get the fire keep burning in his heart. Keep making him believe that he has to be ready to run at any given time. He will be unstoppable in the final race. It was a gamble. This could have ruined the horse, though. A lot of horse trainers will tell you they would have never have done that. But, Lord behold, the final race comes. His opponent is running him down. And then towards the final stretch, he fucking took off. I haven't seen the movie in a really long time. I actually do remember seeing that movie in theaters. Yeah, the, the movie does not exaggerate his length of how far away he ran away from his opponent. Fuck! Six lengths, seven lengths, ten lengths, and still surging. He was over 14 lengths away from his opponent before he crossed the finish line. Jesus Christ. He was a machine. And it blew everybody's minds away. And that's what I love about that story. This horse did the impossible. But I also love Secretariat because that's more like of a little guy story. Yeah. Um... Sea Biscuit, sorry. Oh, yeah, Sea Biscuit, yeah. I still, like, every time I think about... Oh, cool, I got the Moon Pearl. Um, every time I... Um, every time I think about the movie Secretariat, I still, like... I just picture as that as one of those um, 
those serious sport movies that Disney would make. Like, there was The Miracle, and there was uh, The Rookie, and, um, what was it, uh, The Invincible? It was with Mark Wahlberg. I don't know about that one. Hmm. I've heard a lot about The Miracle. I haven't seen it. Oh, is that the dolphin one? No, that no, that's um, that's a dolphin's tale. No, the miracle oh. is about the uh, about a hockey team, and it's from the same people who filmed for Secretariat and uh, the Rookie. Are you talking about Miracle oh. Alaska? No, no um, it's a Disney one. movie. Oh, okay. I know it was oh yeah, about the um, the Olympics at Lake Placid when the U.S. beat um, uh. Russell. Mark Russell is in it. Not Mark yeah. Russell. Um, yeah. Russell something. Not Russell Crowe. Oh, God, I, I got the name mixed up. Kurt Russell! That's who it was! <laughs> oh, yeah, the American Pharaoh. Yeah, I, that, that, that horse won the Triple Crown. You know, the funny thing about uh, Kurt Russell and um, um, the movie uh, The Miracle, he was also uh, adult copper in The Fox and the Hound. Oh, okay. Yeah, and adult uh, Todd was voiced by uh, Mickey Rooney. Mm, nice. Yeah. We'll always be friends forever. Shut up. Oh, I watched that movie so many times, kid. It, it broke my heart every time, especially the song that when she lets the fox go. Yeah. There's those ninjas and their onions. <laughs> <laughs> Sons of bitch. Yeah, I know, right? Always oh, it's not just that. Like, uh, Brass Polish posted some new TF2 assets for me, and I'm happy with them. Sweet. That sandwich looks delicious. <laughs> you know, at one point we got to write an episode of TF2 where, like, you're just uh, like you're nomming on a sandwich. Again, you, what was that? You cut God out. damn it! Sorry. <laughs> I think it would be funny. If there would be an episode of TF2, uh, if we were to write one at one point, and it'd be you nomming on a sandwich. Om nom nom nom. <laughs> dom, 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 dom. Om nom nom no, th That'd be a great joke video, like, for, like, a, like a ten minute loop of just her eating a sandwich. Nom 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 nom. Om nom nom nom. I gotta pitch that to Dr. Wolf. <laughs> just me eating the sandwich, that's it? Yeah, just, yeah. just a ten minute joke video. Is this an infinite loop on that? <laughs> Why? That's silly. Ah, oh, fuck me sideways. It's this okay. asshole. Ah. Oh, sideways. I hate this boss. I hate this boss. I hate this boss. You know, surprisingly, when I faced him a few months ago, when I got the uh, NES Classic, I didn't have that much of a problem with them. No, 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 don't, dude, you dare knock me off, you asshole. No, 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 no. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> I will be, it will be a fucking miracle if, like, I face him and I never got knocked up, and I completely jinx myself. God damn it! <laughs> well, you shouldn't do that, that's bad for your health. It is bad for your health. <sighs> I hate this boss. Yeah, expect a little bit of rage. This is gonna be so much fun. Whoa, shit. Jesus, he, like, knocks you far. The knockback is ridiculous. Oh, shit, there's shit, my shit. sandwich. Yes, okay. Just stay distant when the timing is right. No, no, damn it! <laughs> uh. Alright, folks. Laughing. Here comes the rage. <laughs> Everybody, get into shelters, grab your popcorn, and watch the show. <laughs> I could just imagine one of them is going to be like, Are you going to share that popcorn? <laughs> oh, shit, shit, shit. Get over here, you bastard. Fuck, 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 fuck. <sighs> no! Don't knock me off the edge, you fucking asshole. <sighs> yeah, what Lars said. <laughs> <laughs> He's playing.
fucking doom. Oh, really? How convenient. Because this boss <laughs> is my fucking doom. My sin- <laughs> This is- This is the doom of my fucking sanity. What? <laughs> 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 here, bitches! Ow! <laughs> Motherfucker! <laughs> No! Oh, God die. damn it, motherfucking <laughs> cocksucker! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> well, you came at the right time, Ellie. Perfect time. Goldie's raging. Oh, what the <laughs> shit biscuit! I just regret put all his rage. Ah! Oh. Just a rat in a cage. No! No! <laughs> no! 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 no, no, no. Don't touch me! Don't touch me! Okay. Da 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 can't touch this. Oh, don't touch me! No! No! Damn it! Oh! Yes, it's an Ellie all here. God damn, you are peeking like crazy on the microphone. Yeah, your game is really. Okay, I need to check my audio settings. It's probably your game. Yeah, it sounds like your game. No, it's. Oh, god damn it! Right! Shit. Is this better? Yes. I think it sounds better. Uh, <sighs> okay. The audio jack for my headphones on my laptop has died. Oh. Uh, Ooh, so, bad. I can't, I, I can't, my headphones and my, um, snowball. God damn it. So, uh, I am currently stuck using my fucking head. Okay. That also means I'm not going to be able to afford fail. You won't be able to afford a what? I'm not going to be able to afford, like, lines if I have to. Mm. <clears throat> Maybe I need to be able to hear myself talking in my head and... Uh, I feel your pain, Lars. I feel your pain. <laughs> I'm surprised you can hear him. Uh, we can hear pretty well, actually. <laughs> yeah, no, actually, that that's what was so hilarious. <laughs> I thought a sharky got mad in the background. No! mad. Lars is playing Doom, and then when he says this, I would tell you to go to hell, but we're already Am here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm dying in lava, he says. <laughs> oh, god damn it, I just launched myself in the pit. Fuck! Good, good job. GG. <sighs> Shit, I trapped myself. Alright. <sighs> yeah. Uh, Which there do is no watching your profanity here. Yeah, I, I told you before. Yeah, I have the. What the fuck, Lars? <sighs> okay, <laughs> if I'm gonna constant. If I'm gonna be constantly dying, I'm gonna have to like look for um, look for a fairy or something. Wait, how many monsters are you fighting? Wait, you weren't yeah. dealing with a fairy. I always use it. Two thousand nine hundred monsters. What the shit? How do you take on 2,900 monsters? You play Doom, obviously. Oh, and now he's getting all the monsters. Is this the is this the mod that will crash your game? I hold up the Master Sword and you will get the magic if you do. Oh my god, so you're just gonna get all of them to kill each other. Okay, uh, yep, that's what you're doing. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna die. Oh my god! What? <laughs> oh, you're gonna die, oh my god! <laughs> Holy shit, you're gonna die, you're gonna die, oh my god, he's too big. <laughs> he's literally fighting over two, oh, he's dead. Bye, honey, nice knowing you, you're in lava, you're gonna die. Pretty much. Okay, I'm at this tombstone saying, Do hold up the master, master sword. sword. Ow. Hold up the master, yeah, oh wait, never mind. No, 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 guys, I, I will be, I will be. Frank. Fuck! He is playing in a level that has 2,990 monsters. 2,990 monsters. That's insane. <laughs> and they are like your typical cyber demons. Ugh. Cyber demons, caca demons, 
Hell Knights. You know, they are cocks. That's fitting. Giggity. <laughs> he, he's, he, saw, he noticed only two cyber demons that he knows of. There could be more. There are at least three. Pre legendary ones. <laughs> yeah, you're dead, honey. It was nice knowing you. <laughs> hey, how the fuck am I spinning on the screen? Mouth is. Hey, Lars, if you die again, can I have your stocks? <laughs> I mean, till death wow. you die. I love you, honey. Give me your stocks if you die. <laughs> I think you get them anyway. <laughs> Actually, I don't think so. We don't have an insurance policy on that yet. <laughs> so if you die, I get your belongings. <laughs> That's awful. I'm gonna get the oh, health no, insurance, okay? <laughs> no, no. All the all of his belongings go to his good friend Riley. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I have the will right here. It's, it's clearly even not. Know you, Riley. I, I, I have the will right you. here. It, it's clearly he's not Doctor I get all his cards. Like at least he's Metal Yora. Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> I get I all his Yu-Gi-Oh cards. The only friends he I... has met has been Ellie, Chrissy, Keiichi, Doc, Tarek. Uh, I think he's about. No, he's not met Josh. Uh, oh, Silver. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> Jasper, hide the pottery. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, we met. We met. We met in secret, and, and I uh, and he gave me the will. I was clearly knocked off. Nice. Riley, you're full of shit. <laughs> what did I do? I didn't say you. I said Riley. Oh, uh, I thought you said Ellie. Your name is. <laughs> I will actually, I will actually, the next time I see you, I see you. will what? You'll what? I'll bite her. <laughs> I'm rabid. You're gonna have to get, you're gonna have to get through Doc then first. I'm gonna use him as a shield. <laughs> I'll bite Doc too. I don't give a fuck. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> You know, in order to get to Doc, you'll have to go through Josh. And why am I going to care? Uh, Josh wouldn't stand to let her do that to him. Josh would get out of the way. Josh would get out of the way. <laughs> For the TF2 episode, you should have Doc dog be rabid from Ellie biting him. <laughs> that would actually be hilarious if Doc went rabid. Okay, we're gonna have... <laughs> Okay, to pull an old, to be able to pull an old yeller on them. <sighs> I need to oh, find. No, no, don't say that. <laughs> oh my heart! Damn it! You fuck off. I'll never do that right. You stick your tongue out, wiggle it up and down while making a sound. <laughs> 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 yes, no, I right. God damn it. I intentionally didn't do it right. Oh, are you not dead yet? Wait, hang on a second. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm not dead. What the fuck? <laughs> He's still fighting the, over those 2,000 zombie uh, monsters. So I'm hearing all that shit. Meanwhile... I'm trying to. Meanwhile, oh, Meanwhile, at the Hall of Justice. Meanwhile, at the Hall of Justice. Yes, these are. Yes, we are adults. We are adulting, by cussing no, and not. by cussing and swearing like a child. See, this is why I have to be the most mature person in the room. Everyone else is. The adult. hell you've been, Master Code. <laughs> no. That's a good. You very very much. Damn it. Okay, we don't Hello. like adulting. Hell, I know, I'm trying to get that. Ah! I just you saw bastard. I, I saw on Twitter not too long ago, Katie Will had to do something god-awful, something terrible, something nobody likes to do. Adulting. Dun-dun-dun! <laughs> that's, a, that's a dirty word. Never say it again. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Adulting. Hang on. Somebody said drop down the left hole. Hang on, I gotta check this out. Drop. Hang on, hang on. Drop 
down the left, the top left hole. Ah, uh, that's what she said. He's trying to guide me to find a fairy. Probably. Yeah, that would be really useful. Okay, so Still um, which top left hole though? Top left hole, he says. Top left Giggity. hole. Oh, that top left hole. You mean this yeah, that one? Looks like a top. That's it's got to be that one. one. That's the only one. I'm talking about the one with the door. That's the oh. top le furthest left. Okay, he said. Oh. Okay, so I fell in that one, and Jesus I fuck! Good oh, lord! The God but, uh, damn that hat's a hurt. That's like over 700 feet. But <laughs> you found the fairy. Yes, keep oh, it in a bottle. A fairy in a bottle. It's a fairy in a bottle. I'm a genie in a bottle. No. I was yeah. referencing the police. No, you're I thinking was of not. a message in a bottle, not genie in a bottle. Message yeah. in a bottle. I send in an SOS to the world. We're old. I hope that someone get Okay, you don't even have to be old in order to know classic rock. Yeah, I grew up a bottle. There's a reason why it's called classic rock. It's classic and it goes on for ages. Oh my god, they're dead! All of them are dead! You maniac! No! Damn it! <laughs> oh my god, he he's a mass murderer of demons. He's a maniac. Hey, I'm gonna be so upset with you. I sincerely doubt that. Oh, okay. Oh, so You're... this was only 290 miles. Get the so fuck have... out of my way. Fuck it. Get out the way. Oh. Get out the way. Oh, there's Move, the... Oh, bitch. Oh, get the... out the way. I know, right? <laughs> okay, I gotta... Oh, I see it. Let's oh, back away. God. Back away. I... Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. No. Damn it. Motherfucking cocksucker. Well, stop trying to rely on the fucking spin strike. How about you just swing your sword? It's not that easy. Yes, yeah, swim me, swim me. <laughs> <laughs> what? You act like I've never played this game. What's the button? What's gonna happen when See, you press the button? Wait, it doesn't do as much damage, but you have oh, more control. Oh, you are so dead. Run! It's Run! not. It's not so much as trying to like do more damage. It's just trying to just get the damn thing. Because it keeps, like, I have to chase it constantly. Meanwhile, I get knocked off the goddamn edge. The whole Lars is sick. Huh? <laughs> He's all... What game am I talking about, Acharya? Are you still fighting him, Golden? What? You're still no, fighting him? Chris! <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! Oh, no. Oh, no. Yes, you are! <laughs> well, good thing I got one of those fairies. Yeah, uh, I played just about every Zelda game. This is Li um, Link's Awakening, right? And he's... A Link to the Past. A Link to the Past, excuse me. I'm playing, I'm fighting against that fucking snake who can knock me off the ledge. Get away from me! <laughs> no! Get away from me! <laughs> Hi. Shit! I want to be your friend. No! Oh no! Uh, you get rid of me. Shit, up, Brandon. Oh. You get rid of me. Oh, no. Oh. Uh. oh. Oh. Well. Oh, fudge, Packer. This fudge. mother flopper just don't take a hint. Shut How the is it front taking door. this long uh, to beat him, Golden? Yes. Um, you know what? In the room where you smash the pots to heal, there's a crack. There's a cracked wall where you can like put a bomb and see if there's something else on the other side. Of Hang on. Let oh. me. <clears throat> I saw that. Hang on. Let me. Uh, let me go back to the previous floor. Oh, here we go. All right, let's see what's in here. Is it drugs? La, 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 la. Oh, it did nothing. Hmm? It did nothing? 
I yeah, don't know. Even Somebody is... said it's a fake wall. <sighs> it's a great big Can I at least finish the boss? Oh. You should probably good. grab another fairy. <sighs> well, that sucks. Shit, shit, shit. Shit, shit, shit. He's gonna die! <clears throat> it's not the dying part that annoys me. Just this bastard just likes to knock me off the goddamn ledge. I noticed. Fuck, fuck, fuck. <sighs> okay, I got him right there. He's gonna curl around. So it's best to give him space. No! Have I ever mentioned how amusing it is? Watch. <laughs> <clears throat> well, yeah, this is very amusing. Kind of sad, too, at the same time, but at my own expense. Oh, own I jumped into that expense. one. And I jumped into that one. Aww. Ha ha! Aww, that was very nice! I'm not very nice. <sighs> Run away. Don't ever go to that area. Jesus, I don't know why I keep doing that, but I keep going to that area. Bad spot. Bad spot. Uh, you know what? Uh, I'm going to keep myself through the wall here. I'm going to... No! Shit. No! Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> uh. I'm sorry! <clears throat> How many times do you have to hit this flapper? Oh, well, it resets every time he, he gets kicked at. That's why he's so fucking annoying. You have to start all over when fighting this asshole. You have to what? You have to restart every time he, he every time he um falls out of. If every time he knocks me off the ledge, he's a full fucking hill. That's why Brett's getting. Oh, 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 oh. What? What? And I just got <laughs> I, I got killed. Oh, All right, I at least have a fairy. That is very unfortunate. <laughs> All right. I have a fucking fairy. Shit. I'm. I'm actually tired, so I'm having a hard time doing the laugh. God damn it, Lars! Looks like Lars and I are sharing the same pain. Wow, what the shit! Get out! <laughs> Get out for what? What'd she do? Why can't spiders fly? I don't know. <laughs> what is you hoping to gain from all this carnage? Fun. Okay. Shit! No! <laughs> Press reload E to alternate execute. Alright, two more hits. If I die here, I'll have to wrap this up. Okay. Yeah. I mean, as much Where as... Where is your BFG? Fuck. Damn it! Really? The BFG's not suitable for this. <sighs> nice. Shut up. I don't even care. Oh my god. <sighs> Lars does not sound pleased. <laughs> Already then. Are y'all laughing at him? Yes. We, I, we can hear no, him. He's me. cussing. Oh, <laughs> All right. Well, that's the end for me. 
Lars, I think you kind of hijacked Golden's stream because they could hear you. It's hilarious. Tell him I share his pain with the freaking snake in A Link to the Past. Golden says he shares your pain with the freaking snake boss in Link to the Past. <laughs> what? I can... He, he said, you don't know shit. Oh, shit, that's a black siren. I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, you don't know shit, Golden. <laughs> and our hero le healer left. Great. This is just doom. This is colorful hell, he says. <laughs> <laughs> colorful hell indeed. I will be the hero. So he's playing a mod of doom where the monsters have various different colors and each color represents a different level. Black being one of the worst. Like, the more, the different colors determine how powerful they are or how strong they are. So, certain colors like red will mean something will be breathing fire or being strong, and black will be like, oh, you're gonna die in one hit. <laughs> Some part of me wants to make a racist <laughs> joke. Yeah, no. <sighs> I would say it's a compliment. <laughs> Alright, well. <laughs> Anyways, I think it's best that I just wrap this up because this episode I'm already okay. like over. I'm over forty minutes in. Wow. Oh well. Well, uh, usually these go for an hour. Uh, well, will I be able to continue the quest of a link to the past? Tune in next week for Golden Fox Plays. Next episode of Dragon Ball Z.